B-roll day going pretty good. Got all, got all up to date, all the videos edited and they're in the uploading process, which takes a while when you have poor Wi-Fi, which is pretty much the case here. Walking back up to the store up here to get uh, postcards for my granddaughters. I am, uh, today is Labor Day. Took a picture, I hope to show you what it looked like here Labor Day in the 50s. Gosh. I can't, I mean, every time I walk where I can see the lake, it just takes my breath almost. I want to share it with all of you as much as I can. It's not the same putting it on video, so if you're able and have the opportunity. Oh, wow, I don't know if I've seen this view. Look how blue that is. It's just incredibly blue. from going from the lodge back up this little visitor center up here and other stuff oh, I just it just closed my mind how blue it is it's just so beautiful well it's 1240 and I just had the nicest thing happen. Um, a couple that I met that came in last night, they're from North Carolina, uh, Tim and Cindy. They, uh, he knows about through hikers and asked me what he could do for me. And, you know, I really am in good shape uh, when my resupply box gets here. But I was worried about the fuel. I think I've even mentioned that on the videos that I don't have fuel. But I said, I know Mazama Village is supposed to have fuel canisters, but I'm not sure. And if they got enough or they're running out or what. I said, and he said, well, can I give you a ride down there? So they had their car. They took me down to Mazama Village. And as it would be, they had two canisters left on the shelf. And they were the bigger ones, but they was all they had. So I went on and bought my fuel canister and they brought me back up to the lodge. That's very nice. Thank you, Tim and Cindy, the other. Very, very kind and enjoyed the visit. He's a PT, Brian. He's a physical therapist and works there in Charlotte. And she's a emergency room nurse and sees all kinds of things. So I just really appreciate y'all helping me. And you know, it's just people along the way. They're so kind and so generous that that, that uh, do things for you that make life easy and appreciate you caring. All right, here's my here's my canister. I'm, this will do me well into California, so that's good. Well, it's been a good zero day. I've been enjoying time off. I've done very little. Finished up on videos and uh, walked up to the store. Got that ride down to Mazama Village. Been working on a different plan that I'll tell you about in a couple of days if it works out. Um, I had to get reservations at the restaurant tonight, and they are for 7:45, which is going to push me on my bedtime. And, uh, and they're also running behind. So sitting here in the lounging area or the lobby area waiting to be seated so tonight i have this meal on vance and trisha who are working with my wife and, and giving me some money for this so thank you vance and trisha and i plan to order good i'm excited thanks was a good meal probably the best meal I've had on on trail they started out with a shrimp 
cocktail, which I love shrimp too. And then the steak was just really good, very good steak. And um, finished off with some cream brulee. Yum, 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 yum. It's good, very good. So uh, thanks, Vance and Tricia, for that. And uh, everybody, I mean, I've been, people have just been really kind to me, and I appreciate all of you who've been so kind to me. It's been just a humbling experience to see people that want to support you and want you to do well. And I'm, I'm trying. I'm, I really want to finish this thing. So I've got some idea to help me get through the Sierras that I'm going to be working on the next couple of days. So I'm uh, uh, a little bit worried about the timing. And I've been talking to other through hikers and, uh, and Nick actually put the, put the idea in my head. And so I'm going to think I'm going to try something uh, a little a little different, but I I don't know for sure yet, so I'm not going to say much about it. So I'm just trying to figure it all out. Um, good day today. A lot of rest. Didn't do much. Uh, got my videos done and uh, got those all uploaded. With even with slow Wi-Fi, I've been just been staying with this uploading process here at, at Crater. It's not very fast, but I managed to get it done. And uh, you cannot beat this location. It is just a beautiful place. And so uh, it's buildings old and rustic, but you know there's just some beauty in the land that just can't be beat. And to think that somebody had an idea of putting a lodge up here, and, and at the turn of the century was a pretty good idea. And uh, I know sometimes that destroys the beauty of the land, but I don't think it did here. So. Uh, if you ever get a chance to come here, it's 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 incredible. It's beautiful. All right, and that sunrise this morning was pretty awesome too, wasn't it? All right, see you tomorrow. I'll do some hiking tomorrow, and I'm waiting on my box to come. So I'm going down to Mazama Village, and that's where my box is coming to. And then as soon as I get it, I'm headed headed south, headed toward Ashland. So my next my next. Uh, um, Siri, my next uh, section is over 100 miles, so I've got to get to Callahan's at close to Ashland, Oregon, um, with this next resupply. All right, talk to you later. Good night.